Welcome back, everybody, once again to Mapbrook 3 Starlet Skies. I am DJ the Obscure here with you, and we are here in this underground fairy city, whatever you want to call it. We are looking for fallen stars, although something tells me we might find something more here. I'm tempted to just go straight to the top, but you know what? Let's not do that. Here's spiders in this direction. That was cool. <laughs> oh my gosh, okay. Nice start to the episode then. You know what I need, you guys? I need a speed potion. I don't think I have any, though. What is going on here? Oh, look, there's an upstairs, too. Um, yeah. I want to see what you guys do. Okay, well, you die, apparently. That's good to know. We like things that die. Did I just see a creeper? Yes, I did. I hear the uh, shulkers. Oh, these are cars, you guys. Oh my gosh, is it like an underground parking garage? Uh, I jumped. Uh -huh. Oh my gosh, what was that? Uh, oh, I'm going speedy now. Why am I going all speedy? Uh -huh. I think there's stuff above us. Perhaps. Uh, Something gremlin, I think is what it said. <laughs> Oh, hi. Nice to know you're there. He has a fancy little shovel. Look at you, Mr. Zombie. I feel like I'm getting crazy frame rate problems, which is probably the case because we are kind of in the center of like everything right now. In fact, I wonder... I can turn it down and maybe... Give my computer a little bit of a break here. Hey. Maybe you can drive my car. Beep, 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 beep. Yeah. Nova Arcana. Are these like named after different maps? Oh my gosh, we can jump out the windows. <laughs> that scared me. Beep, beep, beep. Okay. Reserved for Flintstones. That's pretty funny, actually. Zungri Tribute... There's a nine iron there. Oh, it's like a golf cart. Very cool. Firestorm's starter car. Oh, there's even like seats inside of it. Who built all the little cars? Um, this is adorable. It's just the boat there. Is there something inside of any of them? I see a, a head there. Oh gosh, the boat is moving me around. It's freaking me out. Press the buttons. Um, the immovable car, I think is what it says. We can dig through these, can't we? I think it's like obsidian, right? Yeah, you can see it breaking. It's just going to take a little while. Wait, is there an easier way to do this? No. Do I really want to stand here and do this? I don't know. I don't know about that. Uh, do I have an axe? I should have an axe. Ride or die, take a look in the back. We got just the thing. What? Um, okay. Clockmobile? Oh my gosh, that terrified me. Garage Gremlin is what it says. Uh, up or down? Up or down? I hear stuff which I think is above me. I had to guess. Nope, it's actually below me then. These guys are a little too easy. They do have that special ability. I'm not entirely sure what it does though. Sells a helicopter. Be cool if we could actually use it to go somewhere. I wish you guys could see my face right now. I just had the like the just yeah, my jaw just dropped open so wide. That was cool. <laughs> just the timing on that. 
I was actually like you know, talking about the helicopter like actually moving and stuff, but the fact that this is this is a, a how does it fly out of here? It's not like this is actually the sky, right? Maybe it is. I don't know. Who knows? But that's so cool that it actually functions as a teleporter. Um. Okay. If we go at this rate, we're going to end up taking forever. I know that there was a downstairs to this place, too. This building also looks important, especially with all the purple stuff all over it. But yeah, just lots of um, lots of different places to go. <clears throat> oh. Um. Do I have... No, that's a trap door. I guess we can make a button. Uh, will that do it? That'll do it. And get out of there. Okay, now we know that those have TNT. Wait, wait, wait. Is that where we shoot it? Oh, that looked odd to me. Like, in there? Yes, indeed. Okay, fantastic. Do we see any more of them? I don't know if I'm aiming right or not. There's still a spawner left at the bottom even when you do that. Like, we should see any zombies that are around coming after us now. Alright. I need a better pick. I need a better pick. Or even just an anvil. Because I have, like, an efficiency book. Oh, I hear animals. That's right. There was also the downstairs. Uh, I forget that they have their little abilities, so we should... Take the map before it activates. Oh, this is area 9, the under hollow. I, okay, we don't want to be here yet then. Yeah, we need to go back up. It was fun while it lasted, but um, we need to go back up so that we can actually finish out area 8. But we did get a kind of a small taste for things there. I'm kind of surprised that they have an area locked behind a, a riddle like that. I'm, I know that they said that you can brute force your way to it. Gosh, this is a long staircase. But it's still just, um, yeah. I don't know. I, I guess it's fairly easy to find, though. What? I'm trying to remember the... Oh, the... Uh, riddles now. Didn't it say something about a fairy's pond? Which, this is the, the fairy's place, right? It's kind of suspicious. Hint, it says, area, okay. I would hope you would be able to figure that out, but you know, when you have people as dense as me out, out there, you gotta take those kinds of precautions. Um. All right, well, the fairy pond, I would think, would be this one right out here, but maybe not. Is a wither flower and a cake. Can we light candles? How do we light candles, you guys? Can I light it with a torch? I would think I need a flint and steel, no? I don't know where uh, Mr. Skelly went. There's a Mr. Enderman. There's iron. Oh gosh, this scared me. 
Um, okay, well, when you have creepers falling on you like that, you probably don't want to just stand there and look up. Oh, gosh, should we go all the way to the start? I think we did, you guys. I guess that means I never actually set my spawn. Hey, we got some wood tools now. We can make use of that one offhand that we got. And I found an axe. Just what I was looking for. Um... I don't even remember the start, you guys. Okay, here we go. Oh, I can't do my jumpy jump now. That makes me very sad. Actually, I don't know if this is the best place to go to... Well, I think it's right over there. Going to the underhaul or whatever might be the better option. Because we don't really have much on us. And we might run into some nasty creatures along the way. Uh, I think this is... This is the fairy pond here. So I, I'm not sure if it's a uh, if it's a rapid spawning if it's a rapid spawner or if you can see it right there uh, or if just multiple had spawned I wasn't I wasn't sure that is the polychrome creeper don't blow up I don't know if any of my things are around here or not. So he's gonna blow up. Oh gosh. They do a fair amount of damage, don't they? Especially when you don't have any uh any stuff. I'm not seeing like any of our items, you guys. Which Oh, don't look at the enemy. Oh, there they are. Well, maybe some of them. Um... Oh, can I not actually... Mine those? Uh oh. My items are like floating in the air. Where is. Okay, I see the hole there now. I think that should do it. I was, you know, when I walked up to it, I was kind of expecting a trap. Um, although we haven't had that many in this map. But it, it, it really is, with the chest sticking out in the open like this, being on the side of the cliff and everything, it really was a great opportunity for a trap. And it worked quite well. Uh, I was like, I hope we didn't lose anything. I don't think we had anything with the Curse of Vanishing on it. Oh, I apparently did have an axe on my, in my inventory. I could see the fairy thing being up here because it's kind of right above their home. I don't see any indication, though, that it's like in this area. In this pond, at least. And I think it says secret very fond or something like that so you would think it's going to be pretty well hidden do 
Do we want to be going up yet, or do we want to... I think we want to keep going around. I was going to say, those are freaking pufferfish that we're <laughs> jumping right into right now. I think we want to keep going around, though. Until so we've covered the perimeter of the area, so that we've know, we know we've done everything. This little bit of land here looks suspicious. Whee! Hmm. There's another one of these little houses off to the side here. I think that at least one of these is a slime spawner. Oh, they're so fast. Oh, uh, let's check it out. Shall we? Um, oh man, really? Spyglass. Hefty greatsword. Plus five attack damage. Minus 30 movement speed. Oh, thank you. And a golden apple, too. Big waterfall. I wonder if there's anything behind the big waterfall. Possibly. Something behind the waterfall. Casa del Topo. With a diamond shovel, oh my gosh. And a flower. Oh. I'm sorry, I ruined your house, guy. So many little things to find. <clears throat> but we still haven't found one of the fallen stars. That's taking us back to area seven or whatever. So, does that mean that we've gone full circle now? Oh gosh. My arrow did not fly the way that I was thinking it was gonna fly. I think there's a baby one after us too now. Who's shooting me over here, huh? Water? Anything down the waterfall? Oh gosh, besides the puffer fishies? There's coal and stuff, but I think this is where we started out, isn't it? Pretty sure. Which means we have gone full circle, although I do see spawners there. But let's uh let's head up now. The next layer, next level, whatever you want to call it. I know you're around here somewhere, guy. Well, I don't know if I saw where your spawner is. Down here somewhere? Oh, man. Uh, it must be underneath the bridge, is what I'm thinking. I 
And this is taking us like... Further upwards, which I'm not sure is really what we want to be doing right now. Ah, that was pretty cool that my thorns killed him. Yeah, this is just taking us further to the top. Hmm. There's a chest right there. But let's go back down because I feel like there's like a whole like middle layer that we need to deal with first. If we go to our left over here. Um, wait, now that I think about it, we didn't do the bottom layer all the way around, right? Because we came up, or we started at the teleporter, which is actually right there. Oh my gosh, this area is just gigantic, though. And I keep finding stuff that I'm just kind of surprised to see. Like, how did we not see that before? Stuff over here. I don't recall ever seeing this. Thought we might have a creeper nearby. Um, ooh, I don't think I've ever seen those used as decoration like that. It's going to be another area. <clears throat> Almost like it's pink wool. Area 11, Ether Castle. Is this the one that we did previously? Or did we do area 10? I forget which area we kind of fast forwarded to. I don't think I really have anything worth putting up. Okay, Fairy Pond, Fairy Pond, where is the Fairy Pond? Or the uh, Offland Treehouse is the other thing that we're looking for. Oh, okay, so they, oh, my thorns will kill them, like, immediately. Interesting. Um, do that and that and that and that and that and that. We've kind of been on these bridges once before. I think we were on the one below us. Okay, that's the bridge that we were just on. The bottom of it looks interesting. Huh. But there's lots of good opportunities for drop creepers here. Guys hit kind of hard, man. Where is this taking me exactly?
Uh, trying to get a sense of the layout of this area is... Challenging. This is going to be the spider spawner. And I know that we've kind of already been over this area though, right? I think we were at one point. You can see our blocks there. Okay, I do see a block here. Like I hear things moving around, but it may just be me. Cloud Ripper with Riptide. And Ice Blocks. Uh, what does this do exactly? Plus six to armor. Oh my gosh, you guys. Okay, um. Oh gosh, okay. That's, yeah. Gotta make sure I have my, uh, water bucket on the bar for that one. Uh, might make it easier to get around. Might also make it easier to kill ourselves. Uh, what do we want it, though? I guess I'll put it on my number six. Enderpearls aren't that essential in this map because we... Um, the void isn't going to kill us. At least, it shouldn't kill us. We, we of course, managed to die to it once, but that shouldn't happen again. Hopefully. I think that maybe we've... Gone everywhere? I don't know. Okay, we ring the bell. Ugh. 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 It just keeps going and going and going in every which direction. I think somehow we ended up on the top layer again, maybe? I wanted to see what this is. Oh. Well, I'm glad I came back. Is that worth it? Um, for the mending, I mean, honestly, it's probably about the same. If we could add some protection to it, though, that would be nice. Oh gosh, that could have ended very badly with the skeletons doing the, uh, the creeper into me. Ah! Man, you guys can't see me. Get your little floaty balls away from me, guy. Did the creepers blow up their spawner? I can't remember now. I think so. I, you know, I could just keep playing this area like forever and ever and ever. It's a really fun area. And there's so much to find and explore. This looks suspicious to me. I got a shovel. Maybe we should make use of it. But, nope. Nothing there, as far as I can see. Um... Uh, this looks kind of curious, I think. Oh, 
Oh my gosh, you guys. I was like, hey, we found something. This is not what I was expecting to find, though. Uh, I mean, there is iron in here. That's nice, I suppose. We might get that anvil here soon enough. So we were just there. How do, how do we keep ending up in places we've been to before, huh? How does that keep happening to us? Oh man, the candles are making me see stuff just everywhere, especially like spawners. That may be the spider spawner that we found earlier. Is this going to take us back around to the webs? It does. Okay. We're back over here now. Oh, let me up, let me up, let me up. That's something right there. I think I see bubbles. Take you out while we can. There's where we died earlier. There's wheat here. It's interesting. And even like a little road. Oh, is that what is that what it is? Is the bubbles just creepers? I hear a cat. Anybody else hear a cat? Or maybe the creepers came from right there and the bubbles or something else. Uh, that is a zombie spawner. But I can tell. Huge vein of coal here. The Hunting Death, Hunter 5. Useful for spiders, from what I recall. And other creature-like things. Okay, so... Is that all you are, is a... Creeper hole? It really seems like it, huh? Should we investigate? Gosh, this makes me think of doing those, um... Oh, those creeper holes back in maps like Vinyl Fantasy and stuff, you know? It's probably nothing, if I had to guess. Well, maybe not. It's a it's it's a farm. Where is this cat at? Is it down here with the creepers? I certainly hear lots of the things. Um, Gosh, with the bedrock hole there. I'm trying to think. I have the TNT on me. I don't know how this is going to... Wait, wait. Okay, I think I need to... Do that... Oh, how am I gonna do this? Yeah, right? And then that, and that, and it should fall right down there. What's gonna happen after that? I have no idea. We'll figure it out though. I would love to know where this cat is. It sounds really close. Like it's like inside of this mountain, or in here with the creepers, maybe. Maybe the creepers are making the cat noises. Who knows? Let's make four buttons. Oh gosh, no, no, give me away, give me away, give me away.
Okay. Did that actually do anything? Oh, come on. I need to... I need to get around here. We're drowning. But we did find the cat. We Did we save the cat? Is that how you do it? Did we win? Did we beat the map? Um... <laughs> All right, more torches, more water buckets. Don't shoot the cat. I need a better bow, don't I? Does this do? Oh no, I don't want to do that, do I? Oh gosh, okay. Where am I? What am I doing? Uh, I'm drowning again, that's what I'm doing. Watch out, Mr. Kitty. I'm coming to save you, guy. Don't worry. I should probably light it up sufficiently, huh? Whew, okay. So I could actually use this as a grinder of sorts. I'm not sure I really want to do that. These creepers are scary. Adeline. Oops, sorry, Adeline. How do I, how do I get you to, to sit up? Do I have to target you with an empty hand? Is that how I do it? Um... Can I get some fish, maybe? The... No, you don't want, you don't want any fish? Is it, it just says tropical fish. I don't know what to do with you, Adeline, but you're free if you want to be free. You just gotta learn how to swim, hopefully. Oh, hey, what's this? Okay, whatever. I think we kind of sort of won <laughs> there. Maybe. Oh, I'm going back down the hole. I just want my blocks back here. All right, you guys, this video has gone on way too long. We didn't really accomplish much, but we had lots of fun. So I guess we accomplished something, right? But uh, that's going to be it for me for today thanks for watching hope you enjoyed and I will see you next time